doing so very well welcome back to another pick a card reading so today's reading is how would they react or how would they feel if you told them your truth okay so whatever that truth may be um yeah all right so we have four groups for you to choose from we have group one two three and four if you want to pause the video to choose whichever group is calling out to you feel free to do so <laughs> but i shall see you all in your readings hi if you chose the first group then this reading is for you so uh how would they react how would they feel uh if you told them or expressed your truth to them all right so we have six of cups we have five of swords upright and we also have the star reverse so how would they react how would they feel if you express your truth to them okay so i feel like if you told this person your truth it would make them reanalyze the past um i feel like for some of you they wouldn't really know how to take it or they would experience like a plethora of emotions um for some of you they may feel like this truth of yours would bring conflict in some way this conflict could be in regards to not moving forward with something or not moving forward with someone for some of you they may feel like you're a little damaged or that you just unfortunately went through a lot or just went through a really tough time or period or whatever it is that you could be uh, telling them for some of you they may doubt that you're being 100 percent honest with them and it's not that they think you're lying but they may feel like there's more to it or or for some of you they may even feel like you're trying to influence them in some way um, again, it doesn't feel like in a liar or manipulative kind of way. I mean, I hope not, right? But for some of you, they may feel like they are being influenced in some way. Or that you're trying to influence them. Maybe a decision. Uh, for some of you, if you told them your truth, they would think that you both are kindred spirits in some way. For some of you, they would definitely feel extra protective over you, though. Um, they would maybe feel like you are softer than you display. Um, this person would be more supportive towards you or they would be supportive towards you. For some of you, though, they may get angry at your truth, um, like they want to hurt someone. So I guess it just depends on what you're telling, what your truth may be. Um, but yeah, for some of you, like, they maybe would react in anger. Um, I don't feel like this anger is directed at you, though. Um, maybe for some, I don't know, it depends on your situation. But I feel like if they, they, they would feel like they want to hurt someone, especially if someone hurt you. But for some of you, they would feel powerless. It's like, even though, I, like, I'm mad and, you know, I want to take my frustration out on perhaps someone that maybe hurt you. It's at the same time, like, this person would maybe feel a little bit powerless as well. They would feel um, a sense of loss. So I don't feel like this person would be distant from you if you told them your truth, but I don't feel like it would go the complete opposite direction as well, you know? So it's like they wouldn't create distance, but at the same time, they wouldn't not create distance i don't know anyways <laughs> so for some of you there they could feel a sense of loss for i don't know i don't know who this may resonate for but for some of you it's like if you told them your truth they may feel like you're self-sabotaging or if you are someone who self-sabotages and you maybe recognize that within yourself and maybe the person you're asking about recognizes that then they may have a deeper understanding as to why you may um you may um self sabotage at times but yeah i feel for some of you it's like if you told them your truth they may react aggressively um for some of you it's like they would almost feel like the the chance to act has gone 
you know, the chance to do something, the chance to make some sort of a difference has gone. Uh, this could maybe be in regards to a contract or a letter. But I feel for some of you, like, this person would feel despair, you know? They would feel maybe a lack of energy. Um, like, maybe if you told them your truth, maybe they would feel drained. Or just lack energy. Um, for some of you, they may feel bored. I don't know if that would be relevant to your situation. But they could feel bored. Um, but yeah, this person is like, if you told them your truth, they I feel like they would focus on the negative. Uh so we have here mountain hill reach your goals and we also have here alien except that you are an unrepeatable spectacular phenomenon nice so i feel like they would see you that way they would see you like wow you're so strong you know like how did you manage to climb that mountain or how did you manage you know so this person would definitely feel like you're strong they maybe feel like you've been on one hell of a journey as well they would feel like your truth or your story is quite unique as well it would make them see you in a more unique way um for some of you i'm hearing it would even make them appreciate your unique qualities a bit more it's like before i couldn't really put my finger on um why you maybe acted that way or why you are why you are but it's like if you told them your truth they'll be like ah like i appreciate your quirks way more now you know okay so we also have his simple pleasures look for beauty that is all around you and we also have do not be frustrated let go and feel peaceful huh okay they have like similar energy let's see so for some of you i'm hearing like they would definitely want to keep things simple with you so whether that be treating you like gently or you know more softer um but they would definitely want to keep things more simple with you like they wouldn't want to add extra complication for you um for some of you though if you told them your truth they would definitely try to let go of this truth don't get me wrong they would digest it they would take it in but if if that truth comes with like some hard feelings or frustration or just knowing like especially if something was done to you that is just you know unforgivable it's like this person because they can't actually do something about it it's like all right let me make the choice to maybe try and let it go so that it doesn't eat me up you know um and so that maybe i can maybe help you to feel a bit more peaceful but i feel like this is in regards to themselves like i feel like they may be really upset or angry at what um it is that your truth could be but they will try to let go of it so that they're in a more peaceful and calm energy So we have here, oh, so you think I'm stupid. Yeah, so wasn't there a message? It, it wasn't that specifically, but there was a similar message to that earlier. I can't remember. Let me see. So yeah, I feel like for some of you, this person that you tell your truth to or you're thinking about it, they would react like this. They would react like, oh, so you think I'm stupid, you know? so i don't know it just depends on your situation i guess but for some of you it's like there there would be some doubts it's like i don't know why that's coming out but yeah so we have here trauma how would they feel such react if for some of you it may create trauma within them like it would like bring about really maybe some negative feelings for sure For some of you, they may even be a little bit traumatized by what you have to tell them. I don't know why, but. So we also have here slow, sticky and wet. For some of you, they may feel like you're slow or they would understand why you're a bit slow. And I don't know which in like in which way they're talking about slow. It could be like pace. It could be motivation ambition it could be you know slow to do something slow to make a decision it could be you know a bit mentally slow if you're like me <laughs> um 
sorry. But yes. Um, for some of you, they may get emotional as well. They may, um, I don't want to say cry, but for some of you, they may cry if you told them your truth. Hmm. So we also have here, I'm worried you don't feel the same. So if you told this person your truth, they may feel worried. For others of you, though, they would want to reassure you that they love you the same, you know. So we also have here, let me feed you. So six of cups. So for some of you, it's like if you told them your truth, maybe they would want to nurture you in some way. Um, for some of you, maybe they would want to take you out to eat. Like maybe let's discuss this over some food or let me just feed you. Maybe I don't know. For some of you, maybe in the moment you tell this person your truth, maybe you both get hungry or something. I don't know. And they, they're like, let me order you some food or let me cook you some food or something, you know. Um, so, yeah, for some of you, they would want to. I don't know if nurture is the right word. I really don't know if nurture is the right word, but they would want to support you in some way, uh, maybe feed you in some way. So we also have here, tell me what it's going to take to make you mine. See, I don't know what, like, I don't know if you're asking about a boss, a family member, a relationship, but whatever the case may be, I feel like if you told this person your truth, they would want you on their team, okay? Uh, so we also have here, I want to do unspeakable things to you. I feel like this card is representative of, like, they wouldn't really know what to say. Like, I could make this sexual, but I don't really feel that for a lot of you. I'd especially, like, you know, depending on who you're asking about. Um, you can take it in a sexual way if that resonates with your situation, definitely. But for some of you, it's like, I wouldn't really know what to say. Um, and finally, we have, I tell my family and friends about you. So maybe it's like, if you told this person your truth, for some of you, they may share it with their family. Wait, family? Friends? For some of you, they may share it with their maybe close family or friends. I don't know if that would be a betrayal to you, though. I don't know. But they, they may, you know, tell other people about your truth. All right. Um, but yeah, that's all I have, though. Uh, group one. I hope this could resonate. I hope it could make sense or be helpful. I don't know. Uh, but I'm wishing you all the best on your journeys. All right. So take care of yourselves. Bye. Hey there beautiful people, I hope you all are doing so good. If you chose this here crystal, then this reading is for you. So how would they react or feel if you told them your truth, all right? So let's see here. So how would they react or feel if you told them your truth? Uh, so the first card we have is judgment upright, <laughs> eight of pentacles reversed. And we have the devil reversed. Okay. 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 Yeah. One moment. Oof. So how would they feel, react, if you told them your truth? So I feel for some of you, it would make them want to move on. For some of you, it's like they would want to move on from a lack of compatibility. Like, this This is someone... I don't know what tr your truth is to this person. Um... But, like, this person would care about a lack of compatibility. Uh, for some of you, it does feel external, but definitely, you know, trust your situation. I mean, trust yourself. Uh, so for some of you, this person may react or feel judgment towards you. For some of you, this could be in regards to maybe leaving something behind. Um, but for some of you, this judgment could be in regards to maybe just taking a step back so I can make um, a decision, taking a step back so I can maybe reflect, um, you know, have some sort of insight and gain a new perspective maybe. For some of you, they, they may ask for your forgiveness if you told them your truth. They may feel bored or disdain towards their life, their home life. Um, their domestic life, maybe a current relationship they have, or it would make them feel disdain towards um, maybe their personal life in general. 
um, this person would feel like they have to be more decisive they would maybe feel like they have to make a judgment call of some kind for some of you they may even feel like a failure Um, this could be maybe due to a lack of expression, uh, whether that be currently or in the past, maybe, uh, especially if that lack of expression is the reason for you telling them your truth, maybe for some of you guys. Um, but yeah, for some of you, they would definitely maybe feel like a bit of a failure. They may even feel like you are above them in some way. Like they may even feel like a correct choice was made, especially if it's for your benefit or for your highest good. They would feel like you honestly made the right choice, like you made the right judgment call on that. But they would feel a healthier attachment to you, though, like they would feel maybe a, a healthier bond or attachment towards you. Um... For some of you, it would make them react in a way where it's like, okay, I need to be less controlling or I need to be less possessive or, um, you know, that kind of energy. Or I can be less controlling now that I know your truth. I can be less controlling, you know. Um, for some of you, I feel like if you shared your truth with this person, it may inspire them to overcome their own addictions, um, maybe their own demons. Uh, for some of you, maybe eating habits, but I don't feel like it... I don't know it could be eating habits i don't know um but yeah it's like if you told this person your truth they would definitely feel like you're asserting yourself a bit more maybe in regards to them or just like in general so we also have here party wait one second actually For some of you, I'm hearing, like, if you told this person your truth, they would feel like they have to make more effort. And, like, the bare minimum is not enough, <laughs> you know? So for some of you, they would feel like they have to make more effort, maybe in their personal lives or towards you, depending, again, what your truth is. So, yeah, we have here party, celebrate yourself. And we have here flush away that all... Bathroom, flush away all that no longer serves you. So for some of you, I'm hearing like they would react by wanting you to celebrate yourself, but they would also want to celebrate with you. Um, but yeah, that's how they would react. Maybe for some of you, they would be excited for you, depending on what your news is, but they could be quite excited for you. Maybe they feel like you're the one that's moving on, like outgrowing them in some way, if you told this person your truth. Um, but yeah, they would be excited for you, though. Um If you told this person your truth, I feel like they would feel like you either cut everyone off, like, you know, snip, snip, snip everywhere. <laughs> but for some of you, they may feel like you're currently in the process of maybe clearing certain things out of your energy, out of your life that are that's no longer serving you. For some of you, you may even inspire them to do the same. I don't know if it would be with the same intensity <laughs> as you. Um, but you would definitely inspire them in a way to, you know, clear out their own life, make healthier choices uh, for themselves as well. For some of you, it's like if you told this person your truth, they may even think you're a little bit of a savage, like especially if you cut like everybody off, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, so, so for some of you, and I'm sorry if you find my laughing offensive, but is what it is you know um but yeah for some of you uh uh yeah they could definitely feel like maybe you have no problem with cutting people off or that you literally severed ties with a lot of people you know for whatever reason but yeah they would feel kind of proud of you though maybe make them feel like they need to step it up a bit more so we also have here life purpose ah okay and we also have trust your gut feeling Okay, so how would they feel slash react if you told them your truth? So with both of these cards, I just feel like if, if you told them your truth, they would maybe feel like your life has some sort of greater meaning, that your life has some sort of greater purpose. Um, 
for some of you they may even feel like you're quite deep or like your goals are quite deep or your purpose on this planet is quite deep maybe emotional maybe uh, empathetic in some way this person like if if you told them your truth they would feel like you are someone who has so much self-faith you know they would feel like you're someone who uh trusts yourself and they feel like if you continue to do that it would definitely lead you to a place um that you're trying to go like it seems like you guys could be quite decisive and focused and you know uh whatever that may be but they definitely i feel I don't know if look up to you is the right word, but definitely some form of admiration there. I can't remember what I was going to say, but yeah. So we have him move on. I mean, for some of you, maybe they would feel like they need to move on from you. For others, maybe something external to the connection. Uh, again, it just depends on, you know, where you're at with this person. But I do get the sense that for some of you, they may want to move on from you. Or move on from something specific within the connection that you guys have. Because I'm being honest, like, from the start, I didn't really get the feeling that they want to move on from you. But, you know, obviously, if that resonates for you, take it. But for some of you, it could either be something external to the connection, like um, something that's making them unhappy in their personal lives. And for some of you, it's maybe moving on. So like whenever I see judgment, sometimes I think of like a new chapter. So for some of you, they may feel like like there's a fresh start here with you or that you guys can start over or you guys can move on and kind of create like a new chapter. I was going to about to say lineage. I don't know if that's important to some of you guys. But uh, yeah, so we have here also, it looks like I'm paying attention, but really I'm mapping out your nakedness in my mind. This is not the time or place. <laughs> okay, so how would they feel or react if you told them your truth? <clears throat> For some of you, they would maybe feel like they can't concentrate. I don't know if it's the circumstances. I don't know if it's your beauty or your booty, <laughs> you know, um, but like, it's like they would be trying to pay attention, but for whatever reason, there could be some distractions or they could be, you know, if you're asking about maybe like a lover or whatever it may be, um, it's like they're trying to pay attention to what you're saying, but it's like you're so goddamn gorgeous, you know, you're like so beautiful. Um, but yeah. So we... <laughs> That's so funny. You are so fudging sexy. And I swear to you, I didn't see that card. Um but yeah for some of you uh if you told them your truth i mean maybe they will uh let me see for some of you if you told this person your truth it would definitely make you come across as way more alluring i don't know if i said that right but it may even make you come across as like even more like sexy or seductive in some way so for some of you it's like i don't know if this person is just incredibly attracted to you so it's like if you were to tell them your truth it's like yeah i'm listening but it's just like you're so gorgeous you know um but yeah so we have his selfish hmm. so i'm hearing like if if uh what are we doing Oh my god, my brain. If, if, if you told them your truth, they would feel selfish. They would feel like, for some of you, they may even feel like you're selfish if you told them your truth. Or, you know, just self-serving or, you know, focused on self, which is, isn't a bad thing, right? Um... But I, I'm getting like they would feel selfish feelings. Let me see if I can clarify that. Selfish feelings in regards. Wait, let me see if it's coming from them first. Would they feel selfish? For some of you, I'm hearing like they would want to be selfish with you. Like they would want to be maybe even slightly possessive of you. 
but maybe like after hearing your truth they would realize that maybe this is not the right approach for some of you guys but for others of you they would maybe feel like they need to be more selfish in regards to what <clears throat> Wait, in, selfish in regards to you. For some of you, this selfishness could be in regards to change. Like a big change that would maybe not only impact them, but maybe a few other people. Um, what selfishness are you talking? So King of Pentacles. Maybe selfish in regards to finances. Maybe selfish in regards to their time, actually. Yeah, I don't know. So we also have here, you are so powerful, you are so brave, I'm in awe of the person you have become. Yeah, so for some of you, it's like they were maybe, if you told them your truth, they would maybe feel like you've come a long way. They would be in awe of you, like there would be this sense of admiration um, coming from them towards you. They may even have the sentiment where they feel like you're quite powerful and they feel like you're extremely brave, you know, and that you are deserving of admiration, um, excitement, like this person would be super proud of you. Uh, yeah. So we also have here, I'm depressed, shadow work. Let's see. For some of you, it's like if you told this person your truth, they would definitely maybe feel like you've had your fair share of shadow work or, um, or that you've done your fair share of healing or recovery in some way for some of you they may feel like you're depressed or that you have some you know like deeper um stuff going on for some of you it's like if if your truth uh, uh, like revolves or is in you know about your mental health in some way then for some of you they may like oh i can see that now you know but for others of you it's like I can see how you how strong you are despite that you know what i mean so um and for some of you maybe even seeing like the progress you've made has been like remarkable there's definitely a heavy like a uh, sexual attraction there <laughs> uh, so if you're not asking about someone whom you can enjoy that stuff with then um just you know remove that message but for some of you uh, they would feel incredibly attracted towards you. Like, whereas before it may have been, I don't know if it was coming from the healthiest place, uh, but like now moving forward, their attraction towards you would be maybe a lot healthier um, in energy, you know? Uh, and finally, we have, I'm not the forgiving kind of person. For someone, For some of you, it's like, if you told them your truth, they would maybe feel like, like that you're not about it, that you're, that you're not a very forgiven person. So it's like that you're not one to play with, maybe, you know. Uh, but yeah, that's all I have for you though, group two. I hope this reading could resonate. I hope it could make sense in some way. I hope it could be helpful, I guess. Uh, but I'm wishing you all the best on your journeys nonetheless, all right? So take care of yourselves. Bye. Hello there, beautiful people. I hope you all are doing so good. If you chose the third crystal, then this reading is for you. So the person on your mind, um, the person on your mind, how would they react slash feel if you shared with them your truth, all right? So the first we have is the Four of Swords reversed. Nice. Four of Cups upright. Mm. And we have the King of Wands. Mm. Okay. Okay. All right, let's see. How would they feel, react if you told them your truth? So extra. Okay, so how would they feel slash react if you told them your truth? I feel like if you told them your truth, they would definitely feel that you are open or being more open, becoming more open, that you're just an open person in general or that you are someone who's quite open-minded. This person would definitely appreciate your honesty, maybe even appreciate your directness. Um, I do feel like if you told this person your truth, I feel like their first reaction or their first energy towards you would definitely maybe be like an energy of 
um, apathy. I don't know if that's directed towards you or just maybe something that's within themselves. Or maybe a bit of both for some of you. Um, but obviously if they're feeling apathetic, then that could be, um, that could obviously, you know, manifest in how they react or talk or, you know, how they interact with you in some way. So yeah, I definitely get the sense that this person would need time to process whatever truth you had told them. Um, they would want to be mentally strong or would want to demonstrate that to you. For some of you, it would make them feel withdrawn from you. Um, like there has been or like there is an emotional disconnect. This person would be glad you're opening up more though. Um, for some of you, I don't know what your truth is in regards to, but for some of you, it's like they feel that you could potentially burn out, okay? Or that you could be headed for a burnout. Or they would be worried that you would burn out or not have enough energy to do something. For some of you, it's like if you told this person your truth, they maybe they would maybe see you in a more extroverted light, or they would just feel like you have a more extroverted energy, maybe than than what they realized, or maybe than what you showed this person as well. I feel like this person, if you told this person your truth, that they would maybe perceive you as maybe coming out of your shell or coming out of isolation in some way. For some of you, it would even maybe inspire them to come out of their own isolation or to be more authentic to themselves in some way, especially in comparison. I mean, not in comparison to you, but in alignment with you, if that makes sense. Um, <clears throat> for some of you, though, even though this person would be glad you're opening up more, I don't know why, but I get the sense that for some of you, this person would not accept your truth. It's like, I don't know why, like, like I'm not going to accept it for gospel or I'm not going to accept your truth as a whole. I don't feel like it's, I'm not going to accept your truth as a whole, but I'm not going to accept your truth as a fact, if that makes sense, you know? Um, for some of you, they may even react by going silent. Like, this could be due to their own, maybe, uh, perception of independence, uh, perception of their, their independence um, as an individual, though. Uh, for some of you, this could maybe point out certain codependency, um, you know, whether that was, you know, their energy towards you or your energy towards them. <clears throat> Sorry, one moment. Yeah, but for some of you, it's like, if you told them your truth, they maybe feel like they need space. Um, for some others of you, they, they would feel like they missed an opportunity. For some, I, I, I do get the sense that this opportunity feels like... Like, this opportunity doesn't feel like a missed opportunity with you, but a missed opportunity outside, external to the connection you have with this person. For some of you, they may even consider separation. Um, they may feel pessimistic or focused on the negative. This person would maybe feel the urge or feel yearning. Uh, I feel like they would definitely feel yearning for you, but I also get the sense that for some of you, this person would maybe have an urge to, um, to maybe do something that's a little self-destructive or uh yeah but i do feel like after they process this emotion you know i do feel like whatever your truth is to this person i do feel like it will maybe play out as like i can't remember what i was saying actually yeah like kind of play out like a process it's like okay uh i need to process it i need to take it in and then i feel like after this energy um for some of you though I'm, i am getting that if you told this person your truth they may feel a little down for others of you they may even uh, feel a little bit depressed 
but I do feel that after they would feel a bit more optimistic, they would feel super motivated, they would feel much more independent within themselves. It's like their passion has been reignited and um, like they've been re-motivated in some way. For some of you, like this is definitely could be in regards to you themselves, but also the truth that maybe you've shared with them, okay? Oh god, I just saw 222. Two, two. How cool is that? Okay, so we also have here school examine your beliefs about being tested. For some of you, ah, okay, maybe that's why for some of you they won't take your truth as like fact. For some of you, they may feel like you're trying to test them, you know? They may feel like whatever truth that you're about to say or that you want to say to them um it could be that they feel like you're trying to test them in some way or trying to maybe even trying to school them or trying to educate them but maybe in a way where they feel like maybe you're i don't know maybe that you don't see them as as intelligent as you are so for some of you it's like depends on how you say it how you word it it may come across as um that you're you know not that you're trying to put this person down but but it's like the way it comes across it can make this person feel a bit silly or like you think i'm silly or you don't feel i'm as intelligent as you are you know uh but yeah where's the other cards gone oh here they are oh wait hold on but for others of you i'm hearing like they would definitely feel like they learned something new um this self it could be in a form of self-discovery maybe you pointed some stuff out about them or you pointing stuff out about yourself or about your own truth has helped them see, uh, you know, certain things within their own life. So for others, for some, for some of you, it's like if you told this person your truth, then it would maybe make them examine or re-examine certain things uh, in their lives. Uh, but for others of you, they would definitely feel like it was a learning moment or a teaching moment. So we also have angel tap into your higher wisdom. Yeah, so I feel like that's the energy that they would be in uh, if you told them your truth, where they kind of feel like I need to go within myself. I need to be able to trust my own judgment. I need to be able to trust my own gut feelings. Um, I need to be able to trust my own um, own wisdom. So it's like, it's, it feels like, I don't know if a separation is going to happen between you and this person, but it does feel like space will be created. But it's like, then I'm coming back uh, with this high energy, feeling driven, feeling ambitious, feeling motivated. But it's like I wouldn't have been able to come into this energy if I didn't seek my own wisdom or seek uh, knowledge or tap into my own, um, you know. But anyway, so we also have here slow down to relax, break to enjoy the beauty around you. For some of you, they would get the feeling that you want them to slow down. Maybe for some of you, they would get the feeling that you actually are the one that wants a break from them. Uh, we also have here silence in the mind. Yeah, similar to the Four of Swords energy. So it says silence in the mind. Let silence guide you to your inner peace. So I feel for a lot of you, their reaction would be to maybe be silent, to um, create space and to maybe, I don't know if find their inner peace, but definitely some sort of reflection or analyzing something or kind of just needing you know space and quiet just so they can hear their own thoughts maybe figure out a way to move forward uh with you and with the truth that you have shared with them so how would they feel how would they feel how would they react or feel if you shared your truth with them Like, this person would be understanding of your truth, but they would also hope that you can understand their reaction to your truth, you know? So we also have you on... So for some of you, this may not be for everyone, but if you told them your truth, they would maybe... Um, look at themselves differently maybe not feel good enough within themselves or just feel like 
they're not on your level in some way for some of you they may even feel judged like whatever your truth may be they may feel judged so we also have here no excuses So what I'm hearing with this card is like, if you told this person your truth, they would feel like they have no excuses to make. Like they would feel like they can't make any excuses, you know? So we also have here, I accept you for who you are. So for some of you, it's like this person would want to know or they would really hope that you can accept them for who they are. I do feel like this person accepts you for who you are, but I don't know if it's like the other way around. That's the problem, like where they kind of feel like you don't accept them for who they are. Um, but this person would react in a way where it's like, would you be able to maybe love me for me or accept me for me, um, tolerate me for me? Yeah. So we also have here, I'm going to spoil the hell out of you. I feel like that's how they would react after after um, processing this period, after processing a period of silence, maybe feeling apathetic. For some of you, maybe even feeling a little bit attacked. But I feel like after they kind of work through those emotions, um, then they're definitely going to be in that King of Wands energy where they're going to want to spoil you, where they're going to be so excited or have a lot of energy or the vibes are just going to be uh, really good uh, between you both again. But that's what they that's what they would uh want anyway so this feels like uh like near future kind of energy as opposed to like like immediately like if you told them your truth you know um so we have here it's not just physical this stuff is spiritual oh <sighs> So what I'm actually hearing that if you told this person your truth, they would want to uh, separate from you, but they wouldn't be able to. Maybe you both are very much physically connected, emotionally connected, spiritually connected, or maybe you just have like some sort of soul tie uh, to one another. So it's like, even though I want to be kind of mad at you, I, I never want to talk to you. I don't want to look at your face. Okay, <laughs> no, I'm joking. Um, but at the same time, they would uh, feel like they can't fully release you because we have such maybe a strong uh, tie to one another, all right? Uh, so we also have here, I'm so comfortable around you. For some of you, they would maybe feel like they can be more comfortable around you. But again, I feel like it was, it's a process. Um, and finally, we have, it's a problem. Let me see. I feel like at first, like the truth that you would tell this person or share with this person, they would definitely have a problem with it. Like they would definitely have a problem with it. They would, they would, they would see you as open minded, though. They would see you as uh, maybe being more direct, but they would for sure have a problem with whatever truth uh, you have to share with them. Um, not in a bad way, but it just may take some time to maybe wrap my brain around it, you know. Uh, but yeah, that's all I have for you though, group three. I hope this could resonate, be helpful, make sense. Um, but yeah, I'm wishing you all the best in your journeys nonetheless, all right? So take care of yourselves. Bye. Hey there, if you chose the fourth group, then this reading is for you. So the person on your mind, if you shared with them your truth, how would they react? Okay, okay, okay. So we have the Page of Cups upright. We have the World upright. And we have the Ace of Wands reverse. So how would they react? How would they feel if you shared with them your truth? Okay. Okay, so if you told this person your truth, I feel for some of you, they may not take it seriously um, to start off with or... Or they will maybe just be in a more so playful energy with you. For some of you, they would maybe confess their feelings to you as well. Um, they would feel special that you confided in them. It would definitely make them see you in a more vulnerable or a sensitive way. 
would this person themselves would feel vulnerable and sensitive. I feel like they would mostly feel that way towards you though. This person would definitely be really empathetic towards you. This person would be happy you confided in them as well. For some of you, they would maybe feel like... It's like if you shared your truth with this person, they maybe would find it quite cute. Or feel that you're quite cute and innocent in a way or in that moment. For some of you, they would want to make some kind of gesture towards you, maybe some sort of proposal. For some of you, this could be maybe like an actual proposal, like an engagement or something like that. But for others of you, this proposal could just be more so of a like a proposition, you know. Um, like, I feel like if you shared your truth with this person, this person may feel like slightly foolish. It's like, I can't believe I didn't catch on earlier or I can't believe I didn't notice or I can't believe, you know, but this person almost feels like a bit naive in a way. Like, um, I feel naive that I didn't catch on, you know, um, I don't know why I don't and I, and I don't know what the, you know, what truth you are sharing with this person. But for some of you, they would feel like it's good news to them um it would maybe generate some sweet feelings in them as well this person would maybe see you as more beautiful or i feel like for some of you they may try to distract you by telling you how beautiful you are like for some of you you may kind of get the sense that they're maybe not taking you as seriously but it could be just because they're trying to make it a more light-hearted kind of energy or or maybe for some of you, they aren't taking it seriously, you know? Um, but I guess it just depends on what your truth is and, uh, yeah, your connection to this person. But for some of you, yeah, they would maybe feel like there's, like, an end of a chapter um, and, like, there's a fresh start here. For some of you, though, they may react impulsively, like their reaction could be quite impulsive. So it's like, like it could be like a laughter or frustration or anger, anger. But it's like whatever their first reaction is, it's, it's done on impulse or maybe like nervousness or just not knowing how to react, you know. Um, but yeah, they may feel it's like if you shared your truth with them, they would definitely maybe feel like a cycle has been broken i do feel like the person you're asking about they would definitely react by being in the page of cups energy like that's the energy um that they would react with like that's the energy that they would be in if you told them your truth all right um i do feel like there could be a mutual feeling of success and victory though uh, maybe even compatibility and love for some of you if you shared your truth with this person then they may feel more like sure of themselves as well. Uh, for others of you, they may want to travel with you. But if this resonates for your situation, they may want to cancel plans that they already have, especially if they are like planning on taking a trip somewhere. For some of you, this person could be reconsidering that. Or it's like if they hear your truth, they will reconsider moving away or traveling somewhere. Uh, but again, that's not for everyone. Um, if you told this person your truth, they would definitely maybe feel like accomplished and victorious in a way. And hearing your truth could have like, I don't know. I I feel like for some of you, maybe hearing your truth or hearing what you have to say or you sharing whatever it is that you're sharing with them. It almost feels like for some of you, they could have been waiting for this day, like waiting for this time for you to do that. Like this could have been their desired outcome this whole time. And maybe that's why they may react in a way that could be, I don't know, I don't know if it could be deemed inappropriate. I don't really feel like that, but it could just be like a bit shocking or it may take like, you know, you may feel a bit taken aback. Um, but I don't feel like it's their intention to like, you know, make you feel, you know, any kind of weirdness at all, you know, uh, but definitely trust yourselves, you know, <laughs> uh, but yeah. So I feel like hearing your truth could definitely have been their like desired outcome for a while. Like I've been waiting for you to do this, you know. Um, for
for some for some of you it's like after you tell them your truth they may react by you know kind of wanting to look after you maybe be a friend to you support you a bit more for some of you it's like if you shared your truth with this person they maybe would feel safe or like they found their place in this world so like you know soul family and you know friends that are like family maybe or just a place or a person where they kind of feel like they can maybe be their 100 percent self especially since now they you know feel like they know your truth or a bit more about your truth uh for some of you this could have been someone that missed an opportunity with you in the past and this person is like never again so if you told this person your truth they would acknowledge like the past between you both but at the same time they would be like yeah we're not we're not we're not trying to repeat that again you know yeah but this person would definitely feel more sure of themselves um like they may even see a more innocent side to you for others of you they would definitely make more time for you as well there would be more understanding of certain delays that may have happened in the past, delays currently. But, is it? But yeah, they would definitely feel um, more understanding. For some of you, they would like slow down in regards to chasing other opportunities as well. Um, for some of you, it feels like just being content with each other, you know, or th that's how they would feel, content with you. So we have here, car, get into the driver's seat of your life. And we also have naked, dare to bear all. Aww. For some of you, if you told this person your truth, like this person would come in like a knight, like this person would be, would want to be like your chariot, you know, they would want to be, they would take action, they would be in that energy of taking action, they would be in that energy of being motivated, being aggressive, uh, being assertive as well. So it's like this person would kind of almost want to rush in like they're your knight in shining armor or your princess in shining armor, do you know what I mean? So um, yeah, they would definitely, uh, wait, hold on. Like, if you told them your truth, they would definitely be more driven towards you. Maybe even driven in general. But they would reconsider some of their decisions, especially if it could potentially create distance between both of you guys. Um, I feel like you telling your, your person, uh, the person you're asking about, I feel like if you told them your truth, it would definitely make them want to be more sensitive Actually, I feel like it would make them want to be more vulnerable, maybe want to tell you a few truths of their own. Um, for some of you, it's like they would be so taken aback with how naked you're being, with how vulnerable you're being, especially if this is something that you are, you know, you haven't really done much of with this person. So, yeah. So, if if what are we doing again <laughs> if you confessed or if you shared your truth maybe it's a bit of a confession for some of you guys yeah but if you shared your truth with this person how would they feel how would they react they would react by being super confident by being a leader for you not for you but being a leader like in themselves like emperor kind of energy like i can show you or i want to show you that i am or this, I don't know, it will maybe make them feel more comfortable being in that energy, being in that energy where, yeah, I feel like I can lead or I can be more assertive or be more dominant or, you know, whatever it may be. Uh, but yeah, so we have here fine wine. Longing is the portal to wholeness. So for some of you, if you shared your truth with this person, there would definitely be something that comes full circle in a way, you know, Um So we also have here beyond the ego interesting 
surrender to the flow of life. So I feel like if you told this person your truth, they would want to be in, like I said, the page of cups energy, that kind of free flowing um, energy, maybe the en energy of surrender and kind of not really uh, having much expectations. But I feel like this is mostly just kind of going with the flow. I feel like this is mostly in regards to like a light heartedness, in regards to like a carefree kind of energy, as opposed to... Um, yeah so let's see okay so how uh what are we doing how would they feel slash react okay so how would they feel slash react if you told them your truth so we have less piss off the neighbors don't hold back For some of you, this person will be glad that you're not holding back, especially especially if you held back because of maybe how external or outside influences, relationships, friendships, situations uh, impacted you. Then this person would be definitely really happy. Um, and it's like, yeah. And especially if you're just like zero fucks given, you know, then this person would definitely feel like, ooh, like I like it, you know. So we also have here, I masturbate to the thought of you. Okay. <laughs> okay, I don't know how this could be even relevant. <laughs> but maybe it might be relevant for some of you. But it's like, if you told this person your truth, it would make them own ray. <laughs> it, would, it would ignite some sexual feelings in them. Let's just put it that way, okay? So we also have, I've been through some stuff. For some of you, I'm hearing like they would maybe open up to you about certain things that they've been through. Like I do feel like they would share a part of their own truth with you. I feel like they also want to let you know maybe that they have been through some stuff. Maybe they can relate to you even on a level. So we have here, this connection will forever affect me. If a strong bond or a strong tie hasn't been it hasn't been formed between you both already, then I definitely maybe see for some of you like if you were to confess your truth to this person, then it would like create like a bond. It will create like a string to one another. You know, um, maybe a stronger one or a visible one. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah. Like, they would maybe feel like, oh, okay, this is going to maybe be something I will remember for, a long, like, longevity, you know? So we also have here Balls Deep. For some of you, they would feel like they could be more deep with you. Like, they could be... Uh, I'm hearing more kooky, like, sharing their, like, weird ideas with you, random thoughts as well, like um like pigeons are my best friend sort of energy i don't know <laughs> but they may feel more comfortable telling you like weird stuff that they maybe haven't told anyone else so we have him meh For some of you, they would be disinterested towards your truth and i guess it depends because i feel like this could be because um because I don't know, it's like, it's, it's not going to change how I see you. You know, I still respect you. I still got love for you or whatever it may be. But it's like they would be disinterested because it doesn't really change how they feel about you, you know. Or it doesn't change how they see you. One second. For some of you, they would be disinterested because they're not that invested anyway. But I guess, again, it just depends on what that truth is. So we also have, you are so strong, but you don't have to do this alone.
So yeah, if you told this person your truth, they would feel like you're quite strong. We have here, I'm not even sorry. For some of you, okay, okay, only take this per uh, message if your person is like maybe younger than you, doesn't have a lot of emotional experience, doesn't know how to maybe, um, what's that word? Like... They haven't developed like healthy emotions or I, d I don't know like a way to process emotions so i feel like if you told this person your truth for some of you it may come across you know insensitive for some it may even come across like i don't really care um this person may even be kind of unapologetic but again it just depends on what that truth is and your connection to this person but for others of you yeah they won't be unapologetic you know um But yeah, I think I'm going to leave it there. Okay, I hope this could make sense though. Um, I hope it could be helpful in some way as well. Um, but yeah, I'm wishing you all the best on your journeys moving forward. All right, so take care of yourselves. Bye.